What's up, everybody? It's Rep Revolutionary Cashmere Brown. That's Cashmere Brown. That's K A S H M I R B R O W N. You may not know me yet, but hopefully you will soon. I'm straight out of Memphis, and this is my vlog for Pay Vacation, my new mixtape that I'm working on. And I'm right now. I'm on Pay Vacation. I'm on a Pay Vacation from work, and I'm working on it. And I don't know if you can hear it in the background, but that's the single to my mixtape, Pay Vacation. Uncle Sam, you can check it out on my channel, youtube.com slash user slash cashmerbrown1. Check it out. Got some views on it. Like, dislike, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Do that. But let's just pause it. Fuck that shit right now because I'm not trying to talk to y'all about that. Even though this is paid vacation, but I'm also want to talk about some other things. Um, so I got off the phone with this guy named Mr. Brown, and this guy. Well, of course, you know I'm I'm not signed right now. I'm unsigned. It used to be signed, got dropped because they said I was a troublemaker, but. Enough of that. Maybe I was. You know, I did some wrong things, and they did some wrong things. But it was just kind of like a mutual agreement. So, anyway, this guy named Mr. Brown called me. Do -do 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 -do. He's like, talking all this, said, do you know about the South by Southwest? You know about that? You know about this? You know about this? I'm like, and of course I knew about some things, but not all things, you know, like. Like, I knew about it, but, you know, I'm an unsigned artist. And he was telling me about it. And he was like, you know you can get paid for stuff like that? I was like, no, I didn't even know you could get paid for that. Being honest, I didn't know. So, because um, I always get updates from coast to coast about it all the time. But, so he was just going off at me about this and that. Um... Trying to decide if I'm doing my research about him. Trying to decide if I want to do some consulting with him. But if I would have listened to my friend Miles, Miles Thompson, you can also check him out at youtube.com slash user slash network redeemer. He does, he does my videos. And you can check out my vi music videos on my page. And check out all his videos if you want to really look them up, just Google Miles All Smiles. Miles All Smiles together, and you'll be able to find them. But, yeah, I was just talking to that guy, and he was just going off. I'm like, damn, okay. I may do something with him. I'm trying to do my research about it. I'm not sure. But, yeah, it's just kind of hard out here. I'm like, you got to put the music, like, you have to put money into the music then you got so much other responsibilities to worry about in the world. And it's, sometimes it gets a little hard, you know. But I'm trying. I'm like, I'm really trying to make it. Let everybody know who Cashmere Brown is and everything. And I'm just trying to make it. Because I know right now the 9 to 5 is not going to get it forever. And it's going to be time to move on, you know, eventually. So I'm, that's what I'm trying my best to do with this music. And I'm, I'm hoping, I'm praying, praying to God that it works. Shouts out to God. Um, he's been blessing me and testing me and testing me and testing me. But I'm going to just leave it up to his hands. Uh, that's the best thing I can do. Um, But, yeah, it was an interesting conversation with him. Just got to do my research on him. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do anything with him or not. He got M stacks. Shouts out to M Stacks. And a dude named Fat Boy that he's also got. Shouts out to him too. Um, if they ever see this video, they probably won't. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much how that's going on it. Mixtape, I'm not giving no for sure dates on it. Because my engineer is probably she's gonna pretty much perfect it. She's gonna gonna take her time with it. Shouts out to Miss AM Star. Love you a lot. Um, she's the one that made Uncle Sam and 
I finally see what good quality sounds like thanks to her. Shout definitely shouts out to her. So just go check her out. Official Miss AM Star. And shouts out to the producer Crush. I know you don't wanna reblog the song on your page because you probably think it sucks ass, but hey, thanks anyway for letting me buy the beat exclusively and yeah, everybody likes it. Thanks for making that amazing beat. But right now we're working on paid vacation. I got beats for it. It's going to be some covers and then some originals or whatever. And I'm trying to make it into my own thing. So that's pretty much how a paid vacation goes. And then um, I'm also with a group called FTR, Friends That Rap. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Friends That Rap. Go check us out on Instagram, Friends That Rap. You know, it's going to look like Friends That Trap, but check us out, Friends That Rap. Um... Yeah, we got a show coming up at Memphis Nights. If you're in the Memphis area, go check out Memphis Nights. It's on Kirby Parkway. The address is 3299 Kirby Parkway. Check us out August 5th. We turn up. We never turn down at any show that we do. Um, but as I was saying, I'm Cashman Brown, straight from Memphis, Tennessee, working on a new mixtape called Pay Vacation. If you want to know more about me, find me on Twitter, underscore Cashmere Brown, K-A-S-H-M-I-R-B-R-O-W-N. Instagram, Cashmere Brown, K-A-S-H-M-I-R-B-R-O-W-N. And same for SoundCloud, soundcloud.com slash Cashmere Brown. Find me, find me there. But another thing I want to talk about, also, um, while I was talking to this Mr. Brown dude, he asked me a question I did not know the answer to. It's kind of fucked up. And I'm a hip-hop artist slash rapper. I'm an artist before anything. So, I, you know, he asked me, you probably don't even know who invented rap. And I was like, wow. I was like, damn. I was thinking about that. I was like, oh... Um, I honestly I really didn't know. I really didn't know. And I feel like as a hip hop artist and a rapper, you there's some things you need to know, you know what I'm saying? It it's history, it's his story, you know. I think it's some things you need to know. So I did my research on it. Um and I tweeted the guy, blessings to DJ Cool Herc. He did an amazing thing for the hip hop movement. And what he did he basically started out in one place, Jamaica, I believe, and brought it to the Bronx, where it was just torn down and everything. Cause that's that's how the hip hop energy is from. Hip hop energy is not from the riches and uh, gold chains and all that stuff. It's not from that. It's from the bottom. It's from devastation. It's from the struggle. It's from all the, you know. Roaches and the, you know, rapping for the basement, just pure, like, poor and broke. That's where it's from. And what he did is he basically took it over, brought this sound to the Bronx, like, sampling and breaking James Brown songs and stuff like that. And eventually finding artists like um, African, Africa, Bambada, and Grandmaster Flash, and then the lady... I think it's Sylvia, something like that, created Sugar, uh, the Sh Sugar Hill Gang, you know, and basically finding them, and you know, that originated hip hop. So I had to do my history on it because I think you need, that's important to know. I think with any artist, that's important to know. I don't care what kind of hip hop you do trap, hardcore, underground, gangster. Just doing it for fun, I think that's really important to know. I think it's important to know our history. Because we need to learn our history in order to move forward. And we need to know and learn from their mistakes that they did. So I think it's a good thing to know the history of anything, whether it's any type of movement or just any type of progress or business work ethic, um, politics, even though I fucking hate politics, 
just anything. I think it's important to know your history and know, because that's my passion. And I had to thank him because he gave me, you know, thanks to him, I finally, I know a passion. I know what I want to do. So that's what I'm going to say. Blessings to DJ Cool Hurt. Love you, man. Thank you for doing what you do. And you're alive and kicking and still doing what you're doing. That's cool. Um, and shouts out. Blessings to African Bambada. Grandmaster Flash. I love him. And Sugar Hill Gang. Everybody from there. So, yeah. That's my video for today. I wanted to get that out for today. I may do another one tomorrow. More than likely, I'm going to do another one tomorrow. Yep. I'm going to do another one tomorrow. Sorry that it's so long. Because I know y'all not going to watch the whole 10 minutes of this. But yes. Find, like, comment, subscribe. Check out my other videos on my page. Uh, like I said, Instagram is K-A-S-H-M-I-R-B-R-O-W-N. That's Cashmere Brown on Instagram. Underscore Cashmere Brown for Twitter. SoundCloud.com slash Cashmere Brown. ReverbNation.com slash Cashmere Brown. Shoot Vine, Cashmere Brown. Shoot, just, and my mixtapes on that pill. You want to check that out. You can Google Cashmere Brown. Check that out. I'm everywhere. And, yeah, definitely follow, like, subscribe, everything. Thank you for watching. It is the rep. Revolutionary Cashmere Brown, and I am signing out. Thank you for watching once again. Thank you. I'm about to fuck up the rap game. Fuck all y'all text brackets. Been making money off text brackets. Been making money. Been getting money. He's still spinning.